the state capitol in downtown Sacramento. We've got just 33 days away from the midterm election and state Republican lawmakers today unveiled their California promise with about a month until election day. The group is urging California voters to reconsider the state's Democratic supermajority in the state legislature to create laws and determine how the state spend its taxpayer dollars. Our KCRA 3 Capitol correspondent Ashley Zavala joins us live to explain their pitch. Ashley. Lisa and Andrea, ballots will hit mailboxes across the state in just a matter of days, and Republicans who work or are hoping to work here at the state capitol are urging voters to pick members of their party to bring back balance into the state legislature that has held a supermajority Democratic uh, power in, at, at least the last two election cycles. Republicans face an uphill battle as they say they're hoping to bring accountability back into the state legislature. And we need to make a change here in Sacramento come the 8th of November. The that, plea from Republican state lawmakers ahead of Election uh, Day. Republican. Party leaders in the state Senate and Assembly urging uh, voters to reconsider who they send to the state capitol this today. year, blaming Democrats for the state's high cost of living. The Democratic supermajority has had their chance to improve the quality of life, but instead they've made things much worse. The group did not provide specific policy proposals, but made a set of promises to tackle the state's issues, including affordability, education, crime, water supply, fire response, and the homelessness crisis. Our promise to Californians is that Republicans will act. Republicans face a few hurdles as they attempt to chip away at the legislature's Democratic supermajority. The latest numbers provided by the Secretary of State show Democrats make up 47 percent of registered voters statewide, while Republicans account for about 24 percent. No party preference and other account for the rest. Polling shows abortion will energize Democratic turnout with California's Proposition 1 on the ballot, a measure that would change the state constitution to guarantee the right to an abortion and birth control. Republicans say they are not so concerned. That's not changing at all in this state, right? We're focused on the problems that are really pressing matters in the state. In the state Senate, of the 40 seats, Republicans have nine of them versus 31 Democrats. A similar situation in the state assembly of 80 seats, Republicans currently have 19 versus the 60 held by Democrats. The party is zeroing in on about 10 competitive races to help the party either hold on to or flip districts in the Central Valley and Southern California. If you've never voted for a Republican before, we're asking that you give us a chance a chance to make good on our promise to you. Now up on KCRA.com, we have a breakdown of those key races Republicans are targeting this cycle. We did reach out to the California Democratic Party for comment, but we have not yet heard back. Reporting live here at the state capitol, Ashley Zavala, KCRA 3 News.